Only a day after putting out photos of what they're calling a person of interest in connection with three hotel arson fires, Crime Stoppers tells us they have received tips and also a name. Sarah Madison joins us now with a follow up to this story. Sarah? Howard, the man has not been located at this time, and that's why officials have not released his name. Now, during this time, the Hawaii Lodging and Tourism Association is also sending updates and alerts to hotels and guests to bring awareness. Officials continue to search for this man, who is a person of interest in three arson cases in Waikiki. Fires startled hotel staff and guests at Alohilani, Waikiki Beachcomber, and the Hilton's Grand Waikiki Inn. We asked these hotels what security measures are being considered in light of these incidences. Alohilani officials tell us they are following all necessary safety precautions to ensure the safety of their guests and associates while the incident is under police investigation. Hilton Hawaiian Village says it did not want to publicly disclose details, but the team has reviewed the incident and will make any appropriate changes. Mufi Hanneman of the Hawaii Lodging and Tourism Association says this is a high priority for the visitor industry. The good news is that the uh, individual in question uh, has been identified. Uh, so we are sending uh, updated info on this suspect through the security alarms and we are working very closely in conjunction with uh, the Honolulu Police Department. We learned during the emergency two rooms were burglarized at the Waikiki Beachcomber Hotel. Hanneman tells us some of the doors were not shut when guests rushed out and made it easy to get in. In terms of what we're doing uh, to make sure that everybody uh, recognizes what's happening, we are putting out an extra alert to all our guests to please shut and close their doors uh, when they evacuate for alarm. That to me was the biggest problem here. Now, Crime Stoppers and Honolulu Police are asking the public's help. If you have any information, please call Crime Stoppers at 955 8300. Back to you, Bridget.